to my kitchen. Um, today we're going to make jam, and this is super pectin compared to my last pectin that I've been using. This is for freezer jam. You can make, it says, uh, apricots, berries, cherries, grapes, pears, plums, peaches, any jam. So look how easy this is. We went out and picked some raspberries this morning. We have, we need four cups of raspberries. This pectin works good with frozen berries you can buy at the store or freshly picked. Either way, so I'm gonna pull about a half a cup out there. Need a few more berries. Okay, now in my last pectin, it's the MCP. You needed four and a half cups of sugar. This one you only need one and a half cups of sugar. Awesome. So we're gonna pour that in and crush for a few minutes. Okay, now we do the pectin. This is seriously as easy as making instant pudding. So, I'm so happy. Now this will make five eight ounce jars of freezer jam. It says stir for three minutes, and then you can go ahead and pour it in your, your jars. So, I'm gonna stir for three minutes. Okay, it's been three minutes, and now we're gonna pour it into our jars, and we're done. That's so easy. I'm gonna just use a scoop here the sides. Now this pectin you can buy it at a Kirk Walmart. Um, I just got it at my local grocery store. I go to a Kings. But anywhere where they sell these ball jars, um, they'll have the pectin there. Okay, my jam is in the jars. Um, so a couple more things. Now you put the lids on and you need to let it sit for 30 minutes on the counter. And then you can eat it or you can put it in the freezer. Um, because my jars are a little bit bigger than eight ounce jars, it only makes two and two thirds of jars of jam. So you may want to stick with those little ones if you're giving them away as presents, the little eight ounces. Um, also, if you have enough, if you have eight cups of berries or fruit, I would use two so you can make a lot of jam all at once. But again, it's just three minutes and 30 minutes on your counter to wait if you want to eat it right away. Put it in your freezer for a year. So. Thank you and hope you can make some yummy jam.